The aspects that keep me coming back to World of Warcraft is all the magic training I'm receiving for when I become a real magician and learn how to stamp my enemies out. The social interaction and that feeling of communal spirit. I was filming Superman Returns the time when WoW first came out and uh, we played a lot. I've always wanted to wield a big sword and be the hero. I've always been drawn to elves. Dwarves. Gnomes. Dragons. Druids. It's not World of Peace craft, it's World of Warcraft, baby. One of the things that Blizzard has always done so well is taking a type of game that previously had only appealed to a really narrow audience and making it much broader. And they did that with World of Warcraft. A lot of kids coming together not knowing the rules, but we were so naive and so hungry, it didn't matter. I wanted to work on World of Warcraft because I wanted to play in a world like World of Warcraft. There's a lot of passion and blood and sweat that went into it. Players are getting invited into the creative process. This is the first time that we've actually allowed cameras. It's really a social experience. The people that I play with have become my family. I met my wife in World of Warcraft. How big a success it became caught everyone off guard. Each pop that you see on the screen is somebody logging in to play the game. We went from a company of 500 people to over 5,000 people. There was this buzz and this energy. It's like, okay, now what do we do? It's overwhelming and humbling. We're charting new territory. I don't think we'll ever stop pushing the boundaries of what we think is cool. It's goofy stories at the end of the day, but when we share them, it becomes infinitely bigger.